the day that you receive your light, you may have been very small, but you also may have been very big. It doesn't matter how big or small you are, you can receive your light anytime. And whenever that happens, it's called baptism. When you are small, the family brings you to church. The pastor calls you by name and puts special water on your head and says these special words. I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Creator, the Redeemer, and the Sustainer. This is the water of creation. The dangerous water of the flood, the water that Jesus was baptized in, and the water that we were baptized in. There once was someone who said such wonderful things and did such amazing things that people just had to ask him who he was. One time, when they asked him who he was. He said, I am the light. When you are baptized, the light of Christ is shared with you and you become one with the light. We use the flame from the Christ candle to light your candle. Notice how the light doesn't get smaller. It stays exactly the same. Brianna, this is your light. Charlie, this is your light. Ashlyn, this is your light. Jace, this is your light. This is your light. This is Reverend Zach's light. And there even was a day when I received my light. Look at all this light in one place. But what if we change the light? What if we could share our light? Watch me change this light and share it throughout the room. The light was in just one place, but now it's spreading throughout the room.
all of our light is spreading throughout the room and it can even spread to further places. Wonder what it was like on the day that you received your light. I wonder how you can share your light with others. Think of all the ways that you can share your light. I bet you can think of a lot. 